The RSPB wants a world richer in nature and one of the best ways of doing that is inspiring as many people as possible. This video is really the way that we want to give people all the information they need before you visit on to see the facilities, to see what kind of quality trails are around so you can make informed decisions about your visit here. Hi, I'm Jackie and I'm a regular visitor to Arne and today I want to share what a lovely place this is. I want to show you how accessible it is around this very special place and Rob, Hi, one of the site wardens, is going to share that experience with me today. RSBB Arne is on the south coast of England in a beautiful place in Dorset called the Isle of Purbeck. It's a bit of a hidden gem and the reserve itself is a peninsula that juts up into Pool Harbour. As you drive down the single track road, you start passing um, the wider RSBB reserve. You really get a sense of, of, the, of the kind of habitat you'll encounter in the reserve. You've got lovely heathlands um, that, that in autumn in the mornings you come in when the sun's rising, you have gorse bushes draped in spiders' webs. Really, really magical. When you get to the reserve, we've got a small car park with a welcome hut. Um, staff and volunteers are in that Vista hut. They can help you find out which trails to walk, what wildlife's been seen, and there's some accessible car parking spaces right next to the hut there. There's a shop and a cafe, so after a walk around the reserve, there's refreshments and optics and bird food and garden, wildlife, things to buy in the shop there. The cafe uh, also has baby changing facilities, it's got accessible toilets, and with some RSPB permission, you can get a pass to drive further down into reserve, down towards the beach that with another accessible car park that really just gets you a lot closer to the wildlife action. So the paths underfoot at Arna are a mix. Some of them can have tree roots on them, some of them are quite sandy. Uh, uh, so if you do have um, limited mobility, it's, it's always a good idea to check in with the, with the staff and the volunteers uh, in the visitor hut before you go out and they'll be able to point you in, in the direction that will be most suitable for you. The RSPB Arna is love for it. It's wild, it's wild nature. Um, and we try and hold on to that world nature whilst making it as accessible as possible to as many people as possible. We have a number of different trails which are aimed at different eases of, of getting around. We've got, um, we're part of the Tramper scheme here, we've got two trampers to, to hire out and we do a huge host of events both on, on the reserve and also uh, online. The tramper makes the reserve so easily accessible. Apart from perhaps the soft sand or the beach, there is nowhere you can't go on the tramper on the reserve. So those with limited mobility is absolutely ideal. I have a mobility scooter that I use on the road, but you couldn't use that around the reserve. And this all-terrain vehicle just makes it so easy. If you've never visited the reserve before, the Shipstore Trails is probably the best place to start. It takes you through a, a huge range of habitats and that's what really makes Arne special. So you go through lowland heathlands, which, which are on here. Um, it goes down to a beach. There's salt marsh, estuary, farmlands, woodlands. And when you've got that huge mix of habitats, that's when you start getting a huge diversity of wildlife. But we've got a number of quieter trails on the reserve as well. We've got the Coombe Heath Trail that takes in a completely different um, side of the reserve. Fantastic views over Corfe Castle and a seasonal raptor trail that goes down to a reed bed. Um, we're hoping to expand into other areas as well in the near future. Um, so, so keep an eye out for that. Around the different trails we've got a number of viewing screens, viewpoints and, and wildlife hides as well. We've been involved here for over 50 years, managing it for wildlife, and it really is a fantastic place to visit. We've got all six native species of reptile. Uh, we've got a huge variety of um, bird life, uh, dragonflies, spiders. We, we're sat in one of the most biodiverse um, areas for plant life in, in the UK. So there's a huge kind of variety of wildlife that can be seen throughout the year here. Well, I've had a lovely time going round Iron, and I'm sure you will too. And thanks very much to Rob for taking me round. I've really enjoyed it, and I know you will too. Please join us soon here. And if you have any questions, look on the website for the telephone number, more details. Thank you for watching.